Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 25th of November 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, find your purpose, create your future, to raise your consciousness, remember why you are here, come out of that spiritual closet and take the steps you need to take to take charge of your destiny. Now this week we're going to be using the Goddess Guidance Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. But as always before we get into this week's reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you so, so much. And thank you to those that have been joining me on a Friday for my weekend reset um guide meditation and oracle card reading it's great to see you there and the fact i get to do uh interact with you and i'm able to uh do three you know do a reading for at least three of you um there which is absolutely amazing and i've got a new show starting with the beautiful sally hart um on the what day do we start in on the 5th of december which is a cup of spirituality tea where Sally and I will be answering any questions you have about anything esoteric, spiritual, galactic, whatever, the basic knowledge. You don't, if it's for beginners up to those that know a lot more. So if you don't know anything um, about angels, spiritual stuff, chakras, you know, anything like that, then this is the show for you because we're going to be answering all the basic questions that you might have. So as always, I give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. So, what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their high good for week commencing the 25th of November 2024? What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their high good for week commencing the 25th of November 2024? Okay, so they're going to make me work for the cards this week, which is absolutely fine. We don't mind doing that. Okay. So this week we have Mother Mary, expect a miracle. Have faith that your prayers have been heard and are being answered. White Tara, sensitivity. You are becoming, oh gosh. You're becoming an increasingly sensitive. Avoid harsh relationships, environments, situations and chemicals. White writing with not a lot of light. Not very good reading. Um, Yemanya, go oh, golden opportunity. Important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them. Isn't that brilliant? So, really positive cards this week. Um, so what they're what the angels, the guides, the universe are saying to you is that whatever it is you've been wishing for, you've been wanting for, this is the week where it could actually come into place, you know that miracles can occur, that those opportunities you've been waiting for, um, you've been working towards, you've been positive towards, are actually going to open up for you um, this week. Um, so, you know, when these opportunities, these thoughts, these insights, these people come your way, take the opportunities that are being offered to you this week to actually, um, you know, move forward with you, with your life to bring in what you know is for your highest good and the highest good of those around you. But do be aware of your um, sensitivity, you know. Do be aware of emotions that are going on around you and try not to get caught up in those emotions. Because if you start getting caught up in those emotions, you're not going to see the opportunities, that are the miracles, the doors that are being opened for you because you'll be so caught up um, in other people's emotions, feelings. So this is a week really to take stock of who you are, to stay in your own bubble, to actually just work with your emotions. Don't allow your emotions to be down or negative or, you, you know, tr this week, try and surround yourself with as much positivity as you can. Change your mindset you know, if so, if a negative word or thought comes in, change it into a positive. This week really is a week of 
looking at the positive positive side of things and not allowing yourself to be caught up in um, negative emotions, whether that's from yourself, from the environment around you, um, from media, you know, from anywhere at all. You know, we all could be very highly sensitive this week to those and we need to be mindful and aware of them because if we give in to them and we allow them to affect us, then we are not going to see these miracles, these opportunities that are coming in um, towards us. You know, so when these opportunities, um, these miracles are coming in, you know, things that you've wanted, you've wished for, that you know are for your highest good, then please um, do, you know, don't let fear or other people's opinions hold you back. Move forward with it. Take those, take that opportunity. This is your chance to shine, to take the steps, to have what you should have, what is your birthright. So take that chance when those opportunities, those miracles come your way and have faith and know that things are working out for you as best they can and how they should be in the divine order of everything that's going on around you. Stay firm and true in yourself. Know that miracles are possible and that opportunity is always there. You just have to look for it work towards it and take it when it offers itself to you. And that's really all the cards are saying to me this week. As always, this is my interpretation of the cards and you may get a completely different um, interpretation when you look at the individual cards or the cards as a whole. And that's absolutely fine. And if you do get a different version or one card stands out more than the other, then please do let me know. I always reply to anyone who uh, comments publicly or privately to me um, with your insights and your thoughts. So we have Mother Mary, expect a miracle. Have faith that your prayers have been heard and are being answered. Stay true. White Tara, sensitivity. You're becoming increasingly sensitive. Avoid harsh relationships, environments, situations and chemicals. Be as kind as you can to yourself this week and stay away from anything harsh or negative and change those thought patterns if need be. Yemanya, golden opportunity. Important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them. Don't let fear and negativity stop you taking those opportunities that come your way. This is your time to shine. So I hope you enjoyed that reading. Um, as I said, please do let me know uh, whether these cards resonated. You've got your own reading um, from them. And don't forget to check out everything I offer. You know, I have my newsletter where you, um, where you can sign up for a, a free PDF to connect with your guides, your angels, or you can choose a future life regression recording, although some people do choose both. Um, and there are other free gifts uh, along the way as well. Um, you know, and I'm always there to, um, if you want to chat, um, to get a clarity call about how, you, where you are, where you're going. And I'm, you know, and I might even pull a card whilst I'm, whilst I'm having the chat with you. Um, and don't forget to check out my new show or my, my Friday show, 3 p.m. And my show starting next weekend, um, sorry, next Thursday, the 5th with Sally Hart, but also... Don't forget to check out my Angels and Destiny show, which if you're watching this on Sunday the 24th, is taking place tomorrow, Monday the 25th. And if you're watching Monday the 25th, it's taking place 8pm UK time. And if you're watching later in the week, then watch the replay. Because I have got the beautiful, fabulous Courtney Levens, who is going to be talking about my favourite subject, angels, and how you can connect with them. And I've personally had a reading with Courtney and the information the angels gave her was so apt, so on point, that I'm so looking forward to having her as my guest on the show this week. So please do um, join us to hear her insights and wisdom. You won't, you won't regret watching this, watching this show. Anyway, have a wonderful week. I'm still offering all my services, Angelic Reiki, Past Life Regression, Future Life Progression. Past Life Regression, so important at the moment to start healing and releasing and clearing all those um, past issues, that baggage that has been holding you back from moving forward. Have a wonderful week.
Take care. Bye.